<laughs> ah! <laughs> trying to sweep the ceiling. <laughs> I just want to get it off. I hear you. Paint this wall white. It has the a door. Little, the door, yeah, sorry. Mm -hmm. It's a lot harder than it looks. So, uh, why are you vacuuming the bottom of your table? The styrofoam wouldn't come off. <laughs> Hello, we are getting ready to paint the walls in my new office. This is what it looks like now. This is brown and this is the color that we're going for. So it's gonna be like a grayish color. As you guys can see, I have my painting stuff on, so I'm looking a little crazy. Wanna say hi? Sure. You excited to paint? <laughs> yeah, you see where I cleaned my brush out yesterday. <laughs> yeah, he already prepped the room, so we're about to start doing the whole thing now. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Done. You're we're excited? Get rolling. Yeah, we're excited. That'll be fun. This is a little GoPro. John did a first coat yesterday, and so I'm adding some more paint to that. Makes it easier to edge, or we'll paint the whole wall once it's edged well. All right, Cindy, so what do you think? How's it going? I think it's going really well. We're making a lot of progress really quickly. What do you think about this color? Oh, I love it. I'm so excited. It looks really good in the upstairs bedroom. So I think it's gonna look amazing in this office. So why'd you pick this color? I like it because it brightens up the room. I just like brighter colors. But at the same time, I think the light gray makes the room just pop. And I really like bright. So I think that'll look really nice in here. Especially with video editing and making videos, you can add color to it. Especially when I have like different decor and everything in here. I can make a little pop of like pink or whatever other colors I want. And I have a, a little couch in here. Well, a little chair, I guess. Yep. So yeah, I think it'll make everything else look good. If I did like a black, it'll just be too dark or something like a dark blue for me. I'm not saying that anybody else can't do it. What about just a white? Um, I like gray because it just adds a little bit of flair. White sometimes can be a little dry. But I mean, white's nice too. But I think I just... Like a little bit of different okay okay it's been 24 hours and the room is done so i'm excited to show you guys what it looks like so let's go on and this is the final product looks amazing what do you think john i like it i think it I looks like really it. sharp yeah the color really pops i think and it makes the room brighten up it looks like it just transformed the whole room so I like it a lot. I think once we add a few things, little touch-ups here and there, it'll be really good. But yeah, I'm gonna paint this door rough white and then add some touch-ups to the wall after we take off the tape and see what we need to add that to. But yeah, overall I think it looks great. So here is my new desk. It literally just came in the mail not too long ago and we are getting ready to set it up.
we got the manual in here. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, we're not gonna read it. We're gonna figure this out. With that. Wow. Rude. What just growing? The legs. The legs. <laughs> oh, I screwed it up. Oh. I actually specifically warned against this in the instructions that I didn't. Oh yeah, because we don't do instructions. Well, that's okay. You don't do instructions. <laughs> I do instructions. So apparently, these legs' position actually matters because they have a hole, and these holes have to face each other. Mm-hmm. And so. This leg has to go here. Interesting. Hopefully, it should have a hole in the correct place. Otherwise, we don't have problems. Yeah, we, ain't, we don't want those problems, babe. We don't want no leg problems. The cable came with screws, and I like the fact that they had an extra screw for pretty much everything in case one got lost. Mm -hmm. But it didn't come with any washers that I could see, which I'm not mad because I keep things like that here. But the problem is the metal is so thin, like I was pointing out before, that it would be very, very easy when you tighten this little head and that big slot to kind of bend the metal. Mm -hmm. You can actually see this is kind of deformed a little bit. Yeah. And because the metal's so thin, so the answer is you just put a washer on it. Uh, you know how uh, static electricity is, you know, surprisingly strong? Yeah. Yeah, I got I got some proof right here. <laughs> These, yeah, the styrofoam is stuck to the bottom of this table uh, with static electricity. So that's awesome. Oh shoot, not that great, apparently. Not that great. I ain't got lights and everything. That's you cool. want no secret? What? I am not lucky anymore. I'm not left handed either. step back a little bit. I think it looks good. I like my little addition. It was in my old apartment. So it looks good or whatever. And it like matches my couch. Okay, so as you guys can see, we have added some stuff to the room. We have added the desk. This is what we were building before. So the desk looks really good. We added a little mat for my mouse and just like to give it a little bit more of an aesthetic. Of, I like the pink color. So the colors in this room are gray, pink, and teal so that's kind of the thing going on here so we're going to mount this monitor up on the wall so all these things right here are what are we're going to use to mount it so make sure you tune into the next video because we're going to have that part in there and i have a few things i added here i have a little case that has some of my books but i'm going to add a shelf that's going to have more of my books and other things just to have more um, of my stuff in there and i also added a candle over here that i might put on some shelves so we're gonna add shelves here 
and I'm gonna add this little canvas, my candle, and then probably some plants or something else to decorate it. If you guys have any decorating ideas, also let me know in the comments because I'm trying to figure all this out. I also have my rug right here. So this was for my apartment, but I'm thinking I'm going to change it to gray. So I ordered a gray rug and we're gonna to change that up. Add my little couch or chair, not a couch. It's teal with this nice picture John just added up. And we're gonna add some curtains here to give it a little bit more pop, but I don't know what color yet and what we're gonna do for that. So we're gonna add some curtains. As you guys can see, these blinds need some work. So these are gonna be replaced pretty soon. So we're gonna figure that out as soon as possible. I have this coffee table that I had from two years ago that John made. He's always doing me stuff, so thank you for that. I'm gonna paint this probably like a pink, either pink or teal to give it a little bit of a pop. And I'm going to have this right here, but trying to figure out if that's gonna stay there. Cause that's kind of my makeup table. As you can see, I have my vanity mirror and my makeup. And so, yeah, just trying to figure out what I'm doing here. So enjoying the whole process. But if you guys enjoy this video, make sure you tune in for the next one because we're going to be doing the final touches of the room and who's gonna mop the computer. So don't forget to subscribe and we will see you in the next video. Bye.